The balance was there. I was not afraid. I know I was dying. And out of this aspect, I, two days later, I said, I would like to be not die in the hospital, why I saw the people around me dying also, and it was very difficult uh, to relax, to not afraid of dying. It was the fact more that uh, people around dying with dying, and it was I was in peace, and the people dying around me, I could not help them, I could not help myself, so it was not a good situation for me. That's what I felt. So I asked if they can transfer me somewhere where I can die peacefully. In between two to three weeks, actually, the, the sound of the staff, what they're talking, the patient, what, what I saw and how they're smiling and what they're doing, and I said, wow, what is this place? They're dying or what's going on here? So this was my question for myself. In that moment, when I questioned, my life came back to me. Then uh, when you question your life and your uh, uh, surround, then um, it was something um, questioned my life. And then that brought me back. That, that, that and the will to live brought me back. Uh, they talked about miracles, and, but I said, no, it's not a miracle. I think it's more the fact that uh, uh, what I'm doing and the spirit and everything else what is in me and what I'm doing in the, in the PCU, it's more the fact that uh, uh, not the medicine healing me, it actually, the, 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 this, this uh, uh, psychology in myself made me stronger. And the place where I'm living made me stronger.